why she bring that bounce back? Chopper with my house at. I just got a new hoe. Fuck her with a couch at. Her guns with attachments. 30 in a new mat. All black forces on. Kick him with his mouth at. Alright, what up? Doing a little bit of vlogging, you feel me? <laughs> I'm going to California in a couple hours. I'm packing right now. My flight leaves at 8.45 and it's... 4 13 or some shit right now. I'm gonna just take you guys along with me. It's kind of gonna be like a day in the life, but it's not gonna be one day. That's not gonna be my typical day, <laughs> but it'll be a vlog. You guys will have something fun to enjoy. I made it to Cali. <laughs> Yesterday we went out to Santana Row and we ate at Fogo de Chao, but I forgot my GoPro, so I didn't record anything. I don't know if I'm doing anything right now. I might be doing something this weekend. I got some stuff planned. I don't know what you're gonna see, but I just wanted to update you guys that I'm here and I made it. <laughs> well, thank you. Okay guys, what we have right here is a pizza with gorgonzola. We have some apriums, which is an, a cross between an apricot and also a plum. Out of this world that we brulee, just a little tiny bit of sugar, some caramelized onion, 50 year balsamic, and some toasted walnuts. Enjoy. Thank, Thank you. you. And in true New York fashion, fold it in half. Get oh home. yeah. Hey. That's how pizza was supposed to be eaten. <laughs> hey, nice train, brother. <laughs> train light. Wow. That's wild, right, brother? Wow. That's good. This is That's my wife's good. favorite pizza. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's so good it got me crying. Huh? It's so good it got me crying. <laughs> it's so stupid. Yeah, I just had the crust. I was like, damn, this is good. <laughs> oh, at least I don't even know what's in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> it's delicious, though. Mm. All right, guys, so this is our sushi course. I'm going to have some fun with this. So at the bottom, we have a cracker that I made out of squid ink and sushi grade rice, mm -hmm. some cold smoked salmon, avocado mousse, wasabi aioli, a burnt sugar soy reduction, caviar with salmon roe, and finished off with a little bit of sprouts to bring that earthy and freshness back to the dish. Ooh. I like to put it in this bowl so it looks like it's fish swimming, swimming on the bottom of the sea with the rocks and nice. the waves. Enjoy. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Do we eat the rocks? <laughs> you can. <laughs> That's right. Now he's asking if he should eat the rocks. <laughs> no, don't eat the rocks. My bad, don't eat the rocks. <laughs> We have one lady. I was like, dude, oh, take that out. No way. <laughs> yeah, there's always somebody. It's on my denture. Mm, yeah, it was an older lady too. She broke her too. <laughs> that's pretty cool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> oh, that's good. Cool stuff, right? That's good. I like everything, to be honest. This is amazing, bro. Thanks, bro. I appreciate it. This is next level stuff. <laughs> that Alaskan king salmon is the best one, man. Everybody goes, oh, you should just try the other one. I was like, nope. King salmon. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, it yeah. has to be because it's got more oil in it. So yeah. when we smoke the fish, yeah. that natural flavor goes in, it goes around that fish. Whereas when you buy these uh, other salmons, they uh, farm raised. I don't buy none of that farm raised stuff. Man. Mm. I only got this stuff on top. Uh-huh. right on his ear. You got little teeth already? Barely oh, starting. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> Barely. Barely. Oh, actually, let me show this one because this one's pretty cool. How's the flavor, Nemo? Okay. So good, yeah. It's delicious. Lots That's crazy. Flavor. What is it? It's drunken lobster. Right, I won't I'll feel like you. it's clean enough. <laughs> <laughs> Are we doing it, uh, almost? Yeah. Oil in the pan, salt, pepper, please. And give me a pan if you'd like to make the sauce for this, Not please. Not bad. <laughs> <laughs> really it tastes like chicken. It doesn't even taste bad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> The texture is a little weird. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I can get used to that. <laughs> this is good though. I usually don't use seafood. You miss this a lot. Yeah, I think that's enough trying. Next course. <laughs> but no, I got a big party on Saturday. Is it like a wedding? Oh, no, it's a family reunion. Oh, nice. oh that's fun. Oh, I like these ones. So we will see. Thank you. Camera ready. Uh -huh. Yeah, so let me Enjoy get my me. camera ready too. So Thank you can put this whole compilation together. Mm, right? Okay, wait. Okay guys, so what we have right here, this is our pasta course. Mm. This is a chipotle, chipotle honey gnocchi mm. with uh, broccolini. Okay. The Parmesan we use for this is a three year Parmigiano Reggiano from Italy. You're gonna love the way this tastes. The flavor is insane, and the smoke brings out the flavor of the sauce that's in there. So I'll count down from three, two, one. Dang, that's pretty sick. <laughs> Enjoy. Mm, thank thank you. you. Wait, what is a gnocchi? It's a potato. It's like oh, pasta. potato. Dang, this looks good. Potato pasta, brother. Dang, that sounds really good. Little pillows that kind of just uh, melt in your mouth. <laughs> Oh yeah. <laughs> Told you bro, that's fire, man. That's fire, for real. Yeah. That's how we get up. 
That was really good. <laughs> there you go. It's not too hot then, guys. We're good. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. That's good. Here's what you guys are really going to love about this. I made this gluten-free. So that way it's not going to sit in your stomach mm -hmm. super heavy. Mm -hmm. It's very, very light. Yeah. Perfect. We've been trying to do clean eating lately. <laughs> that cup for cup, Nemo, is good stuff. Good, yeah. good gluten-free uh, flour. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Water doesn't look Thank so fire. Okay, guys. So we have right here is a 37-day age USDA prime petite sirloin uh, topped with some uh, roasted maitake mushrooms, mm -hmm. a uh, emulsion sauce that we make uh, using three different kinds of uh, red wines, Merlot and Cabernet. Uh, and two different heads of Cabernets and one Merlot. We reduce them all down to get this really, really rich uh, flavor on that. Seared uh, yam over the top of that as well. A little bit of edible 24 karat gold mm. and some micro cilantro to just bring that everything back together. Enjoy. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. this is amazing. Bon appetit, guys. Yeah. Bone oh, apple tea. Oh, is this yam? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, look, I think this sauce 24 karat gold. Wow. <laughs> Meant to be. I like gold. I love gold. So what this actually is, is a chocolate almond brownie macaroon. Oh, uh, filled with the chantilly cream. So it's almost like a chocolate brownie whoopie pie. And on the side you have a caramel that we made, a really beautiful chewy caramel with a floor de sel from France. Enjoy. Thank, Thank you. you. So much. Hey. If I've ever said bone apple tea before, <laughs> I mean it right now. I know, we're making me feel bad now, but I think we're gonna make some more macaroons for you guys. I'm right? not, yeah. I'm not gonna argue with you on that one. <laughs> no. I promise you guys are gonna love the way that tastes. Hey, I want to eat this. Deconstructed brownie. <laughs> mm. Is it good? Oh, good. I want to know how to eat it. Do I hide it first or do I like open it and put that in there? <laughs> That's actually hella good. Don't eat it. I'll eat yours. Stupid. It. <laughs> it took five years to learn these damn things, guys. The way you change the structure. Really? Yeah, but it's a labor of love, man. So it means a lot when I see everybody enjoying this. Oh, it's delicious. Mm. Oh, don't thank make, you. Don't make eyes. Thank you. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> thank that. you. Enjoy. Thank you. Thank you. Like I said, it's different than just what a regular macaroon. Very, very sweet. This right here, I wanted to put layers of flavor, a fudginess to the bottom of the cookie, but a crispy top. Literally tears making these things. I mean, like I see it with, with this cookie right here, man. It is a pain in the ass to master these things. When you oh yeah, them, that's what I hear oh is that they're so God. hard to- And I only make them at night so because I need them. If, it, if you make them during the day, there's too much moisture. It's too hot right yeah, now. Yeah, that's crazy. And everything deflates. It's, it's a trick. Well, I'll tell you what, I stopped making these for, I didn't stop, I couldn't get it. So I was like, you know what the hell with this? I'm gonna figure something else Mm -hmm. And I kept going back to it and one day I finally got it. It was like at four o'clock in the morning. I don't know what the hell. I was reading a Martha Stewart book or something. Mm -hmm. And I just started writing all kinds of shit down. And, mm -hmm. Okay, this is the way we're gonna do it now. And so far it's been good, but it's a pain in the ass when you make it. Yeah, I know. It's like the consistency is so good. Thank you. That was good. I wanted to have a fudgy macaroon. Usually yeah. they're not like that. They're they're one note. So I wanted to have layers to this. That was really good. Mm -hmm. How'd you guys like the caramel? Was that pretty good too or what? Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Thank you. Cool. What is that? These look like little buntinis. Thank you. Canale de Bordeaux. That's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> pretty much a dark rum cake. Mm. They say a lot of, any, any pastry chef, their mastery is decided on can they make this dessert. So you guys tell me if I knocked it out of the park. That's the goal. And oh, yeah. apple douce de leche over the top, uh, chantilly cream on the bottom, and a little bit of just fresh uh, sour apples around the side just to bring all the flavor together. Bon appetit, guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. This looks fine. Cool flavors, Nemo? Uh, oh, good. yeah, it's delicious. I'm gonna it's tell crazy, you. It's crazy, right? Freaking, this is really good. Hell <laughs> good. Very rich, but. Hell good. Gets the trick done. Mmm, man. That is delicious. That was crazy. That was delicious. Thanks, brother. Hell of flavor. You guys are the first ones, dude. Really? Yeah. I this today, bro. I've made them before, but it wasn't. You know, finally, I feel like I've got the recipe where I want it. Nobody's tried this at all except you guys and my wife. She was there eating a whole damn bucket of these. Don't make yourself sick. Everybody's gonna love it. For sure. That thing is 100% proof rum. Yeah. That's what gives it the color, bro. Oh, really? You That's burn good. rum and sugar together yeah. to put the color. Oh man. Oh, I didn't. Oh, what the hell? 
The apple? Oh yeah, that was like a perfect addition to me. <laughs> it goes great with it, huh? The last yeah. little bit of flavor there. I like the crunch. It's like this. <laughs> That's what it's supposed to do, brother. Exactly. Bro. Yeah. Check it out. So like the batter before it even goes in, it's super thin, bro. Mm -hmm. So then it cooks. It takes 50 minutes to cook these damn things. 50, 50 minutes, man, just to cook these things. Damn. And if it's not buttered correctly, it won't work because you have to pop them out when they're hot. Yeah. You can't let them like normally you let stuff sit in the pan so it cools down. Yeah. You have to pop it out when it's hot or let it form a crust around it. Mm -hmm. So it's like something like and you eat it and it's good. Yeah. But like the artistry behind it, it's tough. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like master pastry chefs. Man. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm not no master pastry chef, but shit, I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I think that's it. That's good. Uh. <laughs> All right, we're still in the day in the life. You feel me? <laughs> we're here in the test scene. We're going to a baseball game. We're going to the Mariners game. They're playing the Angels. That's pretty much all I know. <laughs> I'm not a fan of baseball, but we're going to slam some beer. So <laughs> it should be a good time. I'm picking up my friends and then we're leaving. So I'll see you guys there. <laughs> Hi. Hey, we in Seattle, baby. We're here. We're here in Plus Seattle. You feel me? We just got, <laughs> <laughs> got dig down. We got, we got the real Mariners fans and the two bandwagons. <laughs> what is something bad to say like at a Mariners game? Like, fuck Mariners. Like, is that bad? Look how many people there are. That's crazy. There's hell of people. <laughs> Turn it off! Come on, it's dark! Everybody, it's dark! So, the Mariners are playing today. It's going to be the first time they'll make it in playoffs in 20 years. If two other baseball teams lose. I don't know much about baseball. I'm here to just watch. <laughs> hey, we're at the game, baby. There's hell of people. My first game, too, so it's kind of crazy. We got our seats. We're pretty close. That's just crazy. <laughs> I definitely need to go to NBA or NFL game. This is cool, but I don't know anybody. <laughs> Who's Rojas? <laughs> Abraham Cora. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Imagine if <laughs> Enron. What are the odds of that? Throw it back because a home run. That's the other team. Uh, well, I would have took it. <laughs> <laughs> what is the score? It's four two. No, six two. Angels are up. Hey, imagine if we could like rent this out and like play a game of kickball or something. <laughs> That'd be pretty sick. Huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm serious. <laughs> oh, I knocked that shit off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's 7 2. Get up. <laughs> hey, all the bases are filled. Could get crazy. Hey, that looks fire. <laughs> if they hit this home run right here, the game will get lit. Hit that shit. Hey. <laughs> Chug it, chug it, yeah? Kill the rest. Chug, 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 that's a verb, I'll tell you it's a verb. <laughs>
We had to come back here and watch the Seahawks play one day. Seattle's beautiful, bro. Look at this place, man. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> Man. Hey, you guys got a race. Where's Julio? He's somewhere down there. Uh, I have no. <laughs> He's right here. <laughs> hey, hey, I'll be at the bottom. Just don't run into me. Everyone, who's going? Julio are going to race. And I'm going to be down here. We'll see who finishes first. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> Who's winning? I can't even tell. Who is that? Is that Julia? <laughs> hey, I want a rematch. <laughs> you smoked him. I took off the train dates from mine. <laughs> the what? I guarantee you guys won't beat me. <laughs> hey, to be fair, I should use my face. Hey, let's go right. get up. Hey, Julio won race one. Oh, who's gonna win? Julio, who going Emron? Who goes in first place? Julio's in second, Emron's in dead last. Ugo burns the competition. Hey, who goes in second, Emron's third. And then go back to it. And then. Train mode off? Oh, is that why? Wait, so was there Max the whole time? That's why I lost. <laughs> hey, that's a Mickey Mouse ring. I need to go again. Hey, y'all. Hey, I think it's alright. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, I'm <was> <laughs> <laughs> no. smoking Hey, we're done. We went to the escape room, we lost. We went to this Mariners game, they lost. We just took a hell of L's today, but. <laughs> I was just recording that, but we're having fun. We're gonna call it a night. But hey, if you like the video, like the video, comment, subscribe, all that good shit. Hey, say bye. Stop.